hey what's up in today's video i'm going to show you how to make instagram logo on color draw 2020 how to make the logo and color it as well so without further ado let's step into it so right now you're going to locate your uh what's it called rectangular tool click on that and you hold down your control key you drag it just like this to draw a perfect square you know uh a rectangle can you see that so the next step right now is to go over uh, to uh it's a shape tool then you uh put the <coughs> your mouse you know to the edge of the uh what's it called to the edge of the object then you drag it in just like so so then you click right here round corner so the next step right now is to copy this inward just like so then you go over to uh, your shape to adjust the round you know corner right here can you see that so the next step is to copy inward just like so drag it inward then when you get your destination you right click then you it on your shape to to adjust around just like so good so right now what you are going to do next is to let's combine these two select these two uh, object then you go over combine so right now the next step right now is to go over and click on rec uh, ellipse tool so hold down your control key then you drag to draw a perfect circle just like so so next step make a copy you know punch your mouse to the edge of the you know what's it called circle then you hold shift shift key on your keyboard hold it down then you drag it in when you get your destination you right click so select these two combine then you center it within this object can you see that so right now the next step is to go over to the right hand corner and you hold control key to draw a perfect circle as well then you adjust it you know <coughs> drag it inward make a copy of that when you get your destination you right click good so combine the two together together as well so right now we are almost done with what we are doing so all we are going to do is to uh, change the whole thing to white then you go over select the uh, bigger object which is this so what you are going to do is to give it color so let's give it you know uh, rare blue then you go over to locate what we call interactive field to hit on that then you drag you know on the object just like so so it left you with uh you know real blue at the top then you know white at the down part of the object you know this is what we call a gradient effect you know with the help of interactive feel too so the next step right now is to double click you know this place to add a node then you change the color right there to red then you go over to uh to change the down part to yellow good so now adjust the uh, color so bring that down a bit then you bring this down just like so can you see that so what you're going to do right now is to reduce this whole thing right here to make it look real then you right click so right now good so we are almost there right now so what we are going to do next is to go over and uh, change our <coughs> click on interactive field to then you go over to this you know at uh, the taskbar right here to change the uh, what's it called to elliptical fountain so 
then you adjust that just like so good so bring it down a bit good 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 so right now <coughs> we are almost through so let's adjust this a bit then you go over to adjust the round you know good so so here we come to the end of the tutorial don't forget to subscribe to my youtube channel by clicking on the button below to subscribe and don't forget to uh, <coughs> give this video a thumbs up you know so that other people can benefit from it <coughs> so right now this is the outcome of what we've created so far you know you know <coughs> see you some other time bye